Good morning. My name is Bill Howard. I'm the Vertical Product Line Manager for Makino, and I'd like to thank you for joining us this morning for today's webinar topic. And the topic of today's webinar is Extreme Accuracies, Blends, and Tooling Matches on Long Cycle Time Die Mold Parts. First off, we're going to go back and look at, well, what do specs say, normal specs? about long-term accuracy, so things such as geometry, squareness, straightness, parallelism, positioning, and, and repeatability. And then what happened? Why is over time so important? Well, what's the difference between a short cycle time and a long cycle time? Well, obviously, the longer you're cutting, the more the effects of the dynamics, the roll, pitch, and yaw, the thermal effects in the casting, you know, the ball screws, the motors, the guideways, the axes, and the heat up of the spindle, the environment itself, changing temperatures in your work zone. How does all of this impact long cycle time parts? We'll also address what can be done to address these issues, basic machine structure. We're going to talk about exacting geometries, minimizing dynamic impacts, and thermals. Then we're actually going to go in and use some application examples that you'll see later. We'll talk about a pyramid test, which looks at X, Y, and Z. Spindle point test that looks at X and Y. Machining accuracy, which basically is a boring test. And there's another one that we look at that's a die plate machining test. We'll also look at spindle growth, and we do that through a z-axis test, such as surface contouring and parting line. We'll also talk about special techniques for in-process things we'll talk about is a hybrid ATLM, which is automatic tool length measurement, tab dies or scoring dies, uh, fuel cell compression molds, and we also have an example of the hard disk cavity. 